Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Twisted Paper Studio. How are you? I hope that you are all very well and having a blessed, wonderful week. Um, I'm going to make some ephemera for this book that I'm working on, the Curved Spine book. And um, I might be using the ephemera elsewhere too. So I'm just going to make some ephemera with you today. Kind of not finding my crafting um, groove. So I figured I'd just take some stuff out and start and turn on the camera. I hope you guys are all well. Um, beautiful blessings. Shout out to Joanne's Not So Fast Life. Whitney Coster's. Mary P, all the way from New England, Mary, um, Lindy Herlock, and So One of a Kind Crafts. Beautiful, beautiful blessings to you guys. Um, thank you so much for joining my channel and being my crafting buddy. I'm looking for, I'm looking for this, oh, here it is, it's over here. Well, we have this bag here. Um, I'm looking for some bases to start to start my crafting. What do I have here? Now I have a bag. This is the second bag I've taken out now. Let me see what I have. A bag. I have some envelopes here. Hmm. 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 What do I want to do with these? Yeah. Oh, that's French. I need to save that for now. I'm a French hoarder. I hoard French things. <laughs> hmm. I don't know. What can we do? What can we do? So, do you guys hoard things too? I know a lot of people say they hoard things, but do you know that my family calls me a hoarder? they do but you know what I'm not a hoarder I'm a genius <laughs> I'm a genius that's right you can walk on my floor wait a minute what about these <laughs> what about this what can we do with those I I make I dye these and then I I um I have a wood burning stove with some iron and when the iron gets hot I put the paper on top of them and it, it makes that design. Isn't that cool? Um I'm just trying to look here. I want to see something. This is right about the same size. I'm gonna do one up high, one down low. Open says me. I don't know what I'm going to create here. So the the weekend is coming. And it's Halloween weekend. I like this look. Open. This could be a pocket. This could be a pocket. That could be a pocket. I like that look. Hmm. Maybe we got something going on here, guys. Maybe. Mm -hmm. um, let's just start. Let's just start. Well, I need to cover that up. Let me roll up my sleeves. Um, I have some pages I could use for collage. Let me roll up my sleeves. Okay, where's my ruler? We need that to start. All right, let's start. Let's just make it. I don't know what I'm making, but we'll just make it. I hope I'm on camera. Let me move these out of the way. So it's Halloween weekend. Um, I don't know what I'm going to be. If any of you follow me on Instagram, you sometimes I, I post pictures. So, and I do have some of my stories, too. But I have very long hair. And um, I think my my daughter and my daughter-in-law-to-be is going to do my makeup like uh, Kim Kardashian. 
I don't know if anyone watches her or not, but I don't watch the show. But, of course, I know who she is because she's all over the social media. And um, I was going to do my makeup. My, my daughter-in-law to be is going to do my makeup like her. And I'm going to um, wear a <laughs> sweats sweatsuit and just put on big black sunglasses and um, new sneakers and just be casual Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Only because uh, I don't want to get dressed up. <laughs> I do, but I didn't take the time to research a costume. Okay, I like that on that side. Oop, I just need to take a tiny bit off. And I'm just going to be casual. I'm, I'm not even going to worry. It's going to be a house full of company. Um, and of course, I'm the mom. So, all the kids are dressing up. I know some kids won't. Some kids just go, some of the boys just go like, um, you know, they put a sheet on <laughs> at, at the, uh, start of the party to say they're dressed. Okay, that works there. And let's do the other side. We'll do the other side in this one. I don't know that I want to use her because I did already use her in the... I did use her already. Yeah, so I think that's what I'm doing. I'll see. If I change my mind... I just have been so busy. I haven't had time to create or look for a costume or I haven't had any of the time like that. None. You guys, I told you my sister is a uh, seamstress, right? And I do have to, one day I have to post pictures. I just have to put the pictures down. She's She's uh, designed corsets. She's made two so far. Man, oh man. They are so gorgeous. One of her corsets was out of uh, toile material. Antique toile material, I might add. Gorgeous. Green. It was green. And then the other one she made... I'm just hoping this works here. I think I'm just going to have to turn this off on here. Um, the other one she made matches her material for her dress. And it's more of like a, um, a linen, like a dark linen. And then it has a trim all around it that's in like a, like a brown. It's gorgeous. I need to take a little bit more off. But just a tiny bit. I have this in my mind from what I want to do, so... We'll see how it turns out. Okay, that's working there. All right, those are scraps. And then this was the middle. So maybe we can just seal this up because I'm gonna make it a top pocket. So we'll do that. And we need to collage it. I did see something. I liked that. I'm wondering how that will look. Is anyone else going to a Halloween party? I did. I, I set my timer today, you guys. Yeah, so my... um, I'm talking all over the place, right? Because I'm trying to... Trying to figure out what I'm doing here. I'm doing this, but I need this to be a flap on here. I want this to be at the bottom. I want this to be at the top. Like that. I think I need to open the sides. I need to open up here. Yes, I do. So let's do that. Let's open these. Let's glue these down. And, uh, Start this. Start the attaching. 
I mean, I was saying, um, I was trying to get to a point with the, with the hoarding. My, <laughs> my, my son and his girlfriend and I were talking and, um, they made mention too when they moved me and, you know, moving a crafter, especially one with years of crafting, um, items and one like myself who firstly, before I did this, uh, I made imitations. I planned parties. I was a party planner. Um, I, I had so many decorations for parties in my, in my, um, you know, in my possession, flowers and vases and, and racks and things I built and, um, mirrors, so many mirrors, um, boards for guest seating, just, just so much accumulated stuff. And then of course I had a love for antiques and vintage items that before I, um, got in, well, I was into this long ago, not this, but, um, long ago I was into making crafts with all of my antique finds and things like that and scrapbooking. So I had all that as well. All the tools that I used to have teach scrapbooking and go to people's houses and bring all my, I have a rolling cart with all my stuff in it. I just had so much stuff and my family had to move me because I broke my wrist which I guess I tell you, right, that my wrist is weak. I have a scar here and I have rods. I fractured it. I, I completely um, fractured it and crushed it into a million pieces. That was, that's what happened. And um, so my family had to move me. And they look at me. I'm a hoarder because they saw what I had and really had to help me do everything. It was it was not a fun time for me. Half of my stuff still sits in storage. Um, right now, currently, I I reside with my sister and her family um, because I lost my job during COVID. I worked at the hospital and I also had all the party planning. I'm trying to look for my hole punch, you guys, but I can't find it. So I might be able to use this. I might not. I don't know if it's too big or not. But I worked, um, I did, I planned parties and I did imitations. And of course, during the start of COVID, all that stuff went out the window. Oh, this just, I hate this thing. That's not nice of me to say, but I really do. I don't like it at all. It never works right. I'm going to, I'm going to go back and just do both of them so I can make it perfect, the round part. Or maybe I should put a piece of paper in there. That's what I'll do. And, um, so my family had to move me. I forget what I was saying. My family had to move me, so they found out how much stuff I really had. Not that I hid it or anything, but, you know, I was very busy, and all my stuff accumulated, and I would just put it away, and I'm looking for something to clip. You know, I have all this paper, and I can't find any paper to scrap paper. Ha <laughs> ha That's funny. Like, I need a hard piece of paper. Oh, here we go. This is good. We'll just use this. We'll just use this. Um, yeah, so they moved me. And now um, they saw how much stuff I had. So I, I still have things in storage. 
Um, I still have, um, I don't have all my crafting stuff with me. I don't know when I will. Maybe someday. I need to do this and get, how did I have this before? I'm sorry, you guys. This is really bothering me and I don't want it to, I don't want to make that circle. Oh dear. Get in there. There we go. Come on now. How did I do this before? I'm just going to do it on top. Maybe that might be easier. That's what I'll do. I'm, I'm wasting your time. I'm sorry. But anyway, so we are, we're crafters, right? We are not hoarders. And you can walk on our floors. And we make things that, and we collect things that inspire us. Um, we use things in our craft that we have. We don't just collect it and put it on the floor and not be able to move in our spaces. I can do this again so I can get it right because half of it was missing. So you just, you need a double piece of paper and this thing works better. So my kids can call me... Uh, hoarder all they want to but my stuff I create with it that worked I create with it and I make things with it and I repurpose it whether it collects it may collect for a little while you know it may collect a little dust but I repurpose it and I sell it. Hoarder, hoarders don't do that. No, they don't. They just bring it in their homes and it never leaves. Yeah. Until somebody helps them. They have things that go on inside their minds, I think, that don't allow them to let go of things. Now, I, <coughs> I do have personal things that, <coughs> that I don't want to let go of. What happened here? I don't want to let go of the personal things that I have because I had a, a childhood that was very different from others. And um, my mother passed when I was 12. And we walked out of the house, my sister and I, with a backpack. A backpack and I, I want to say our bed pillow. And that was it. Um, we went into a, a foster care, my sister and I. So we don't really come from anything. And the things that I have, I cherish them. Now this is going to be a is going to be a holder this is going to be a holder and then this is going to be a holder but you know what I should have done I should have covered that first and then look at me I'm worried all about that and should have covered that first all right I'm too busy talking now I can make the whole bunch on there so I'll do that I'll do this ding a -ling -a. My pan -ling -a. I'll leave the back for maybe a riding spot. That's what I'll do. So if you guys are self-conscious about your stuff that you have for crafting, as long as you're using it, in my opinion, if you're using it and, you know, you have a place for it, a home for it, 
and you may get a little overwhelmed and a little let me put let me cut it this way and a little crowded in your craft room but if you have a home for it a place for it and you're using it and it moves you're not a hoarder and don't be ashamed i'm not ashamed i'm not ashamed at all all of my creativity comes from everything i've ever touched and got inspired by it if i own it still it must inspire me if I no longer own it and I had to let it go, obviously, it inspired me to make something. Okay, I'm going to do this again now. Put this on here. I did my glue book. Get it? I, t I took off the, the bind, the, that thick cover that was on there. You know, Thanksgiving is coming and Halloween is coming and I've never been inspired to make Halloween uh, crafts. Oh no, I put that on there. Maybe I'm just going to turn this around and we'll try that again and I will cover the back in writing. That's what I'll do. I've never been inspired to make um, Halloween crafts. When I was, you know, I used to have the, a party for Halloween every year. Carvings and cocktails. I used to have that. <laughs> but we didn't make paper crafts. We decorated pumpkins. And I served food and we made a drink. My family and I. Well... Actually, I should say me, not we. I really should say me. Because nobody, unless they brought something. No, I don't like that. Well, maybe I do. Oh, wait. Hmm, no. <coughs> Excuse me, you guys. I have to sneeze. Sorry. I'm so sorry about that. Uh, let me use this on the back here. Um... Yes, I had, uh, I always had a party. Carvings and cocktails. Oh, maybe this. What else? If I need something that's going to cover, it's good. Hmm. What do I have? Oh. How about this? This will work. And I like it. I have a thing here to hold my camera for my videos on Instagram and it keeps hitting me in my head. I forgot to I forgot to move it before I started the video. Um let's just do this. I want this right about here. Oh no, I like that. Okay. I like that. This is all because I messed up and punched my hole before. I should have collaged it first and then punched my hole. Uh, I'm going to lose the some of the churches anyway because of the hole. Let me start it over here so we can at least get some of the church. Hmm. I don't even think it matters. It doesn't matter, Donna. It really doesn't. I have a timer on. I told you guys that. I told you that already, huh? I didn't forget. I did not forget this time. And, uh, yes. So I have a lot of stuff. As you've seen, my craft room, um, it doesn't even... You know, you can't really tell unless I opened all of my drawers and showed you all of my craft supplies. And my son used to say, my youngest son, he used to tell everybody when he was younger that my mom <laughs> has uh, 
all the craft stores and all the thrift shops up in her attic. <laughs> I used to have it. My, my, my house that I raised my children in had an attic and that was my craft space years ago. Okay, let's put this on here now so we can assemble this piece. We can get, come on, we can get the base of it done. <clears throat> so a few videos back, I had said that, um, you know, I had sent a parcel to Rachel and she finally received it. And I was so grateful and thankful. And she, she posted a video on her channel and she shared my channel. I was so humbled. I cried. I cried so much. I texted Leslie. Leslie texted me. She was watching it. I was watching it. I was so, so humbled by the video. And, and I was so taken back that she loved everything that I had sent her. She does deserve it. Um, she, she does inspire all of us crafters all the time. Um, she takes her time out of her day to, you know, make videos on a daily basis, although I'm behind, uh, I do watch them. Um, I'm very behind though. I have no, uh, sometimes at night and my internet is so bad that I will put on a YouTube video to watch it and, um, it just keeps freezing. Oh, I hope I didn't make a hole in there. In the envelope I didn't it keeps freezing and I don't I don't even get to watch it so then the other half of the time I just put on a I put on a um a CD like a movie a DVD in my computer and I'll just watch that it's really uh what's the word you know it's very hard to <clears throat> continually try to watch something and it just spins and spins in a like it's loading and it never loads that happens so often okay let's check this out here it's working and I just want to take a tiny bit off the top Okay, that's our pocket. But I, I think that I'm going to cut that hole over here on this side. If I can find what I did with my tool after all that. Is it on my desk somewhere? I probably threw it. <laughs> that's what I do all the time. I throw, I throw everything. I might have to open this up. Is this bad of me? I do this so often. Second guess myself. And then change everything. Okay. Oh, I should have covered that. Because you're going to see it. Let me do that. I'm going to open it and then glue it back together. See? Crafting. Has, you could fix everything you do. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'll just glue it back together. I'll glue it back together. That's what I'll do. Um, I need to cover that with what? How about some, I like that. Some Florentine paper. Is it gonna look good on this side? Let's check. So it's just a piece I need. I like it. I like it there. We'll just put a piece up here and then we'll close it right back up. I could have did that without opening the whole envelope, but that's okay. Okay. 
after this uh, video, after I do some ephemera, I think I'm going to start um, making some of my ephemera. I do have, um, you know, the Christmas coming up, and I, I want to start some Christmas, some Christmas uh, ephemera, and maybe just once a week I'm going to do it so that I can start to pile up the Christmas <laughs> if I need it. And then I'll have some videos for you. Oh yeah, I like that. Okay. And then I'm going to start, I'm going to start put doing some bunny uh, ephemera too. Um, I make lots of things for my journals and I just want to start making ephemera and I, I just I don't have any and normally I make my ephemera page by page and that takes me too long to do <laughs> I want to have an accumulation hey I want to have accumulation of ephemera so that I can pull from it whenever um, whenever I get low. I'll still make it page by page, but I definitely want to have um, an accumulation. Okay, let's get going here, come on. It's taking me too long as I chit chat. Okay, so all I did was put a hinge and I'm gonna put it on the inside because I'm making my, um, I'm closing back up my envelope, but I'm giving it a little bit of uh, um, room also. But I have to do the bottom as well. So let's do that. Mm. What do I have here? I have that piece of paper. Do I have any more? <laughs> yes, I do. Okay. What was that? I have a fly in here. Sorry. I had the window open and a fly came in. Okay. It's beautiful outside here. It's a little bit warmer than you would expect it to be in the winter here. It really is. Yeah, so I'm going to um, be away this weekend at my children's for their Halloween party. And my, um, my boys' grandmother from my, um, my ex-husband's mom, she turns 90. And I was invited to her party, and I think I'm going to go. She's a lovely woman. Everyone calls her Nanny. She turns 90. <sighs> Can't even believe it. <clears throat> And that's and it's her party this weekend, and I don't want to miss it. Okay. Mission accomplished. We have collaged the front, put the paper in the back. I told you stories. <laughs> okay. I'm going to put this on here like that and that has a pocket over there let's do that do I want this blue to show maybe I should have did that first oh, I like my blue that's on there no I like my blue I like it a lot
I dyed these. Um, <clears throat> I had a Easter egg dye. And I used what was left in the Easter egg to um, soak these. This is these are linen envelopes. They were from invitations. I used to make wedding invitations. So these were the RSVP <laughs> invitations. I have so many left. And uh, they're linen. And they're just the most beautiful. They soak up the dye just beautifully. The linen uh in the in linen envelopes. All right, that's this side. Okay, so we have a flip up, a flip out, not up, out, out. I like that. And then a pocket there. Let me do something else though. What do I want to do? Hmm. Hmm. Let me see. Let me see. make a tag. I have um, some things to use here. I'm going to start to use it. Um, how about this? No? It has a hole in it. Oh, look. These are some of the imitations I used to make. But it's on cardstock and it works good to recycle. <laughs> um, I'm going to make a tag for in here. I have an idea. I just need a pen. Of course, I have none on my desk. I've gotten myself into a mess. Okay. We will measure it this way. I don't think it's going to rip very easy because it's cardstock. So, we'll do it the old fashioned way. Come on. Where's D? Um, it's three and a half. Three and a half. I should have measured the length too. but we, we could leave it sticking out. Let's see. Oh, sugar. Three and a half. And then that fits. And then uh, right here. I'll make a little thumbnail in there. <laughs> okay. There we go. So, and this will fit in here. Okay. <clears throat> and then, of course, we need them. Let's see for the side here. This was, let's do this here. If it, oh, it will. I just got to trim it up just a tiny bit. And that will fit over there. We just have to collage that. Hmm. Come on. What happened? Did it get stuck? The glue? We will unstick it. We will. Okay. 
may have to un just make this smaller. We can do that. Mm -hmm. And then we'll make a tag here. There we go. And then, let's see. I wanted to do something on this right here. We'll collage this. Um, we'll get some book page here. We'll start that with some book page. I have an idea. I have an idea, you guys. I don't know where I, what I was saying before. You know, sometimes you forget when you're crafting. Oh, I do know that I, I, we, Leslie and I have spoke, and we might, it might not work for either one of us. We're very, very busy right now, and we may wait until the spring. I'm kind of sad because I really was looking forward to it, but I also understand, and she understands, and we are both so busy with our work. We don't know, um, we don't know um, if we're going to have the time or not. We could possibly have the time. But it's undecided. Right now it's up in the air. It could be a yay or a nay and wait till spring. Which is okay. It's definitely, it's definitely okay. And understandable. So we will see. We will see. Mm. I don't even like that blue with that. Nope. I don't. The problem is, is that I have pages here that I want to do something with, and I can't. Oh, we could do this. I have pages that I want to do something with, and um, they're not for collaging. That's not what they're for. That's not why I have them. <laughs> I have collage pages. They're just not in front of me. Go figure. All right. What are you? I like you. Oh, and you fit so perfectly. Let's put you there. That's a like the perfect size and everything. I didn't even have to cut it. What do you know? Okay. And this side needs to be covered too. So... What else do I have? Something. They're very colorful. Very, very colorful. We'll just go with something not so colorful. Can you help me out? Do I have any? Um, how about... <laughs> Do I want that? No, I don't. I'll find it. Don't worry. I'll find something. How about this? Then we can, then you can write on the back. Now, you're gonna see through it. You can see through it. Let's see if we do that. Okay. We won't see through that. So we will put that on there. And then I will uh, trim it up. Mm hmm. I will. Okay. How about we do it 
long ways. Come on. I think I just got an idea, you guys. Hold on. I think so. Where's my ruler? Let's see. Let's see. Hope I'm on camera. I'll tear this off. Because I could reuse it, of course. And. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to. <clears throat> Do this. I should have done this first. Although I didn't think about this until after. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I'm going to have to straighten this back out. this tag in here like that oh it just fits I'm gonna have to trim it Hang on one second it's got bulkiness to it now let me just find a side this side's more I'll trim this just a tiny bit and then I'll do the other side so that it's remains even it made the flap uneven okay hmm I'll fix that I'm not gonna do it now um one second once uno momento come on okay not as wide but I like it I like it has a little has a little a little tuck we'll make this wider we'll make this flap wider the tag or or we'll just put it here like that I like it we still have to do some decorating not done yet but it's cute so that's cute so a little envelope here a little envelope up higher an envelope in the back with, with a tag pocket a start of a tag um, I'm very sad that this didn't come out even let's try it again it should have come out even I'm going to um, put this here like this so that I can get my line right of where I'm going to cut to and we'll try it that way. I don't have a pen. It stinks poop when I don't have a pen. And right about there right about there I'll bring this forward like that where's my long scissor we will see if I'll get this right hopefully it will be closer than it was oh yeah much better it's not so awkward now all right well, that's my craft today. I'm liking this for a pocket in the book or maybe even <coughs> maybe even to attach down on a page in the book. I like it. We have to stuff it. We have to decorate it. 
What do I have? I have this little bird cage here. Hmm. Let's see. It's cute. <coughs> Excuse me. Very cute. I appreciate all of you. I'm very grateful to, um, I have some new crafting buddies, so welcome. You guys um, had come over um, after seeing the um, happy mail from Rachel. Um, welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel. Oh, I like the little bird down there. We'll find something else to put on the top of here. <coughs> <coughs> I've been talking too much. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let me see. Maybe I like them on the outside. No. Too stark of a blue. I do like that there, though. No. I like it here. I'm going to put him there. I'm going to put the little bird there. I will. And um, like I was saying, well, I don't even know that I finished, but I used to do uh, carvings and cocktails for Halloween, and I don't really decorate with paper too much for Halloween. I have trouble finding that I kind of like the colors. Let me just turn this off. I have trouble finding that I like the colors on paper. That's my hard thing to do. So I think this is kind of Halloween-y, right? <laughs> it looks Halloween. It has the colors in there. We'll just put a, a pumpkin somewhere. And look, I have my little pumpkins here. I got it from the, the dollar store, I think. <laughs> um, I'm liking this. I'm thinking it's going to go well in here somewhere. Either we're gonna, either we're gonna put it down on a page or tuck it in a pocket. But we'll continue working on this. Um, I know it took so long. We'll continue working on this uh, in the next video. And I'm really glad everyone is here. Thank you so much for joining my channel. I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye for now. Thank you for watching.